I apologize for this. Hi everybody! You may notice a couple of little different things about this video. Number one. I've got music in the background. Which is the first time I've done that, but I thought I'd try it, see how it goes. I spent ages on this website, in Compitech, I think it's called, trying to find the right track, and this is as close as I could get to what I actually wanted. But hopefully it's alright. Does it work? I think it's alright. Number two. So, number two, you'll notice that I'm not on my bed. I am standing up, walking around. Again, I just thought I'd try it, see how it goes. I do like being able to walk around. It's nice. It's a bit hard with the lighting. It is a bit bright, but it's better than being too dark, and I didn't want to faff around with the light. So, again, I think this is good, bit of a change of scenery. Got some books up there that probably aren't mine. So the ones that are mine, I think these might be mine. Probably never read. David Seaman, Arsenal number one. I think that's one of my brother's old Kevin and Perry toys. And some sort of T.Y. Beanie Baby thing that I think maybe has the same birthday as me. 4th of April, in case you're wondering. And yeah, if I move out of the way, I think you can see the garden. Look at that, you can. So that's my garden. That D minor is nasty. So no trip to Bournemouth this weekend, but I did watch some sport. On Saturday afternoon, me and Jack and his dad, Paul, went down to the Bull's Head and we watched the England-France game, Six Nations. I know a lot of proper rugby fans give a lot of stick to guys like me who just watch the international games, but I like them. And it was really good. Obviously England lost, which was a shame, but it was a really close game. And they did well because at the start, it looked like they were really gonna lose very badly. They did well to get back into it, and they were just unlucky to lose. Whilst we were at the pub, obviously we had a few drinks, which is always good. And a surprise drop in from my mum and dad, and they brought us chips, which was very good. Jack and I played a bit of pool, and we played a bit of darts. And then after that, we headed down to Weymouth for a birthday party. So we went to this place called Sharky's. Sharky's is kind of like a children's play area, but they've got a license and at night they open up to adults. The party was for Jade, who was going to be one of the bridesmaids at Jack and Sarah's wedding. And I found out today she's got her own YouTube channel, Ginger Jade, both spelled with a J. But she's a really funny girl, so check it out. So yeah, we all got to relive our childhood for a little bit. And it was really good fun. I was expecting it to be a bit odd, running around children's play area. But I think once you've got a few drinks in you, you can just revert to being a child and it's great. They've also got laser tag there. That was really good. I've been playing on the PlayStation quite a bit and it's a good chance to actually do it in real life without actually killing people. So that was good fun. And I came second out of ten. So that was pretty good, I was pleased with that. Once we'd all knackered ourselves out, we just sat around the table and had a chat. And it was really good. There were some people there that I very rarely see, and some that I've never met, and it was great to talk to all of them. <coughs> Today, I'm not going to do much. Still in my pyjamas, it's like... It's two o'clock, I haven't had lunch yet. Probably not going to shower today if I'm honest with you. What are you going to do about it? Not even done my hair, look. Where's my beard? So the rest of the day, all I'm going to do is edit this video, put it up today, promise, and then just lay about a bit. Yeah, so I learned a new song on guitar. Can't, well, don't know that yet. That's not right. I'm learning a new song on guitar, which is The Only Exception by Paramore, which I know makes me sound quite a lot like a 14-year-old American girl, but, but I really like it. I think it's a really nice song, and it's got a certain meaning to me, so I quite like it. And yeah, it's not too hard to play, really. It's a work in progress, but I'm enjoying it. So that's it, I think, really. As always, let me know what you thought of this video in the comments section. Let me know if you like the music and the new background. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. And please subscribe. I think I'm nearly at double digits now, which is sadly very exciting for me. Goodbye.